Welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to couple open form and more die for mooring simulations. Mooring simulations have been popular since uh, offshore wind turbines are popular these days. And open form, of course, has the ability to simulate the floating structure, but it doesn't have the uh, ability to uh, include the effect of mooring uh, cables directly. So the approach is to use uh, open form as a uh, fluid solver and to include these effects uh, by using uh, by coupling with other simulation packages like more time. And for that, we will be using form mooring. It's an API for open form, uh, and it can couple with uh, three different mooring codes: Mordai, Moody, and Netflix Plus. You can see here is uh, one of the results from the web page. These are the requirements for compilation of this form mooring code, and you will be needing open form B2006 and above. Uh, ESI version of open form you need these four digits and because these uh, ESI versions include the ability to run the overset grid and uh, with uh, functions uh, or uh, easy and uh, you will be needing a git Sorry, this is a, a typo. Uh, it should be here. And uh, to clone the, the code and uh, let the git clone again uh, during compiling the necessary uh, software. And you will be needing CMake to compile the file. And you will be needing Vim or Emacs or Nano or whatever text editor to edit the compile scripts okay so the procedure is like this first we will install the git cmake and vim and we activate the open form and move to our user director directory which is wm project user directory and we we'll need to git clone the form mooring repository and it's a must because, as I said before, the form mori uh, compiler will a script will use Git again and again to uh, copy and compile the necessary uh, third-party uh, Moody codes. Uh, sorry, uh, more time codes. So it's a must. And for the map plus plus which is another uh, mooring code uh, we will be needing labac and um, bluff libraries external libraries so it may complicate and your uh, compilation and uh, it may fail your compilation so i will remove the map plus plus and from the compilation uh, script and from the uh, open form library compilation scripts and the rest is just uh, we need to run the compilation script which is dot slash or wmake so let's go ahead and try this okay I uh, removed my existing uh, form mooring library so that I can uh, start from scratch okay so what do we do now is cmake and then okay. so to do this we need sudo now this is uh, by the way this is uh, Ubuntu uh, 20.04 LTS and you can use Mm, like 18.04 or 22.04 mm -hmm. 
LTS version. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, install the git install git in and make we need to input uh password. But actually I've already installed these three so it's just already installed and no need to upgrade. Okay. So we need to move to our uh, project directory. So if you have never used open form or you don't have uh, this uh, wmake project user directory you can create like mkdir minus bot and wmake project directory like this and if it's existing it will not be created anymore and we need to change that to that, that directory wm project And now here we go. Oh, sorry. We'll use our directory. It's the wrong thing. It's a big mistake. Uh, okay, I need to create. Okay. to git clone uh, the software package so I will find the software in Google and just type form mooring okay. here is the direct uh, GitLab repository and we need to click this clone and here it's clone with HTTPS just copy the URL and it clone this directory. It will be cloning to the uh, the files, and we now have the form more. So let's go inside the directory, okay. and we will need to edit the. Uh, make script which is in this all w make file so I will type bin all w make and we can see the script and we need to do something so the this part is the it will compile uh, it will create the sub module from git and compile the more dive v1 and v2 okay so it's these are the uh, separate uh, packages and that need to be compiled and it will compile map plus plus so i will remove that part so let's type i to insert and command out these two lines and you can also remove these moodies but of course you can include this it will not make so much uh, difference and this line show change directory to src six of uh, mooring restraints and they will make like so it says uh, it will change to this directory uh, which is uh, a code a require from mooring code and it will compile as an open form library okay we get out of pen i escape and wq which is write and quick quit okay but if you are not familiar with vim and you are not comfortable you can directly change to uh, the existing files from if you are using 
Linux, it's a bit easier. And if you are using Windows, you need to search these Linux files. Okay. I use the VSL and I need to search the files. And it should be in the users and my account and it will be app data. Okay, local and I think it's packages, yeah. And here it is canonical group sys Ubuntu. This is my Ubuntu and uh, local state and root FS. Okay, so this is the place where these uh, folders, uh, for where these uh, files are stored. So you can see from home and open form. It's a lot of uh, directories. And my version for this is uh, 2206. I have a lot of open forms. And here we, uh, this is 2006. Okay. This one. Okay. Now we can see uh, this directory in our Windows and we will be seeing this all that we make in the beginning okay. and you can uh, easily uh, edit here and uh, save as a new file and it's uh, necessary to save as a new file and you need to copy and overwrite your new file to here in Linux. It's a bit of uh, troublesome. It's a bit of mm, inconvenient. But if you are not comfortable with BIM, probably this is uh, the best way to go. Okay. If you are using Linux, Ubuntu, Fedora, whatever, it's easy. You can just uh, um, edit the uh, these files or in gedit or gini okay so i will continue so the next step is to remove the uh okay i will like uh, test compile all the make and i will see the errors if there are errors let's see okay it now it sub modules the and clone and it will compile these two more time uh, software softwares okay, now compiling okay. <clears throat> it will take us some time and now it finished but we have a problem here it says it cannot re create regular file I, I don't know what this stupid uh, error occurs but you can uh, easily copy the file to uh, this directory and you can easily solve the this problem okay I will show you later it will compile the second package and you don't need to worry if uh, once it's compiled you can uh, easily use it and you don't need to uh, compile again and take some time okay, it's taking a lot of time now it's finished okay now we since we skipped the more uh, moody and map uh, compilations and co uh, cloning it will not uh, end happily it will end with errors but I will show you how to solve these errors okay. but let's go ahead and try to uh, see the errors it's important in open form to read the errors and figure out what's happening what is the problem that's a uh, skill set will help you a lot during your you know, open form life okay. and here we go we have like here errors and these are the main errors so 
cannot find Lapak, Map, Moody, and uh, Dying, uh, uh, more than you want. So, these three are caused because uh, we don't have these uh, Map++ and Moody uh, libraries because we remove that uh, part from the uh, audibly make uh, script. So I will uh, do something to resolve these three and first I want to resolve this one. This one it is because uh, it doesn't have the our modine library. Actually we already compiled here uh, this one and but the copy has some problems. Okay, I don't know why this occur, but I know how to solve this. Okay, so the the easiest way is to manually copy it by yourself. Okay. Okay. So let's go ahead and check whether we have mm, compiled properly. So let's go to third party, and we can see more than we want. And compile. Now we can see here our mod I SO library is already successfully compiled, but not uh, it's not copied properly. So we will be copying uh, to the required place. Okay, so. We need to uh, copy to. I will be reading this again. Um, okay. Form user libbin. Okay. So I will copy cp minus one more time to so to our form. User living as with this name is important. So the compilation is uh, the copying was successful, <coughs> and I will go back and I will need to remove certain lines from the uh, here okay we need to go inside the src and six of more restraints and make and we have two files okay. we have okay, I will open this in Jamie. Mm. the files is the files to be compiled together with uh, our library and we will only be using more time, so these two will be used, and the rest will be deleted. Okay, and in the options, let's see. We these are the necessary libraries to compile, uh, to be used in this compilation, and these line ten to fifteen, no no no, ten to fourteen, are about map plus plus. So we didn't compile the map plus plus and we need to remove these. Okay. And we also need to remove these. This lapback is for use in Mass Plus Plus and also the Map Plus Plus library and Moody. So on the top from the top we have these four five lines, including map plus plus. And in the bottom we need to one two uh, or two and three okay three lines from the bottom and the problem uh, is we cannot uh, move uh, delete here and it will be a little bit tricky uh, you can create a new file and copy by yourself but I will use the bin okay where is the location it's RC and Six of motion controls. Okay. So let's see. 
Stone can go to them like five. Now we have on five. I will remove these. We'll remove line one, so it's one D. Another one line one D. Remove line two. Okay, now we have. Uh, okay, now we uh, remove properly these files, and we need to save and quit. It's uh. Column to be okay. Now these five you can see it here. These are already uh, changed. So another file make option, and we will need to remove ten to fourteen. Okay. okay. I don't like them so much either. So. 10 to 14 D and so this will be removed okay. and I will need to remove line 18 it's uh, better to have uh, the line numbers on your VIN and yeah you can easily do it and uh, by googling okay, I will not talk about it okay. so you need to remove line 18 okay. And now it's line 19. Map 19 D. Okay, another 19 because I want to move Moody. But it, you need to be careful, otherwise, you will delete the required uh, lines. And now you can see here, one we finished. Okay. So we. Uh, All the blue make so uh, we can uh, just uh, uh, use the command to blue make like so here or we can all the blue make in our main uh, directory so I will try to that all the blue make let's see okay it's already compiled so we don't need more compilation for the more time, but uh, the open form library is now compiled. Okay, now we have no errors. We only had warning, and it's okay, and compilation done. So now uh, we finish the compilation. So let's go ahead and test it. Uh, okay. okay this is my test branch we, because the this pre the previous way uh, uh, directory is just for installing the code and so yeah I test here. Um, six talk td and you can uh, test the deform mesh in all over set mesh. Deform is a bit easier to run. Okay. So before running, we will go ahead and look at the tutorial I also. So we have the deform mesh. Okay, oops, I already run it. So. Uh, anyway, I, I will not remove this. And uh, the files necessary are zero, of course, zero or zero org, and constant and system, which are the default open form direct necessary directories. And another one is this mooring file. Okay, and uh, you need to. Uh, include this mooring uh, to do uh, uh, to for the more dying uh, setup and all you need is to just run okay 
It's okay. I, I need to remove the. Uh, 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 log files. Uh, log inter form. Log dot inter form. Okay. Okay. Now if you run. Inter form. You can see. You cannot see it. Okay. Like this. Now we can see what's happening. Now it's running the more die R1 and uh, just uh, uh, it just ignore this warning. It, it doesn't make any uh, damage. And it takes a little bit mm, time. It's a little bit slow, especially if you do it uh, single core, but it's running of course let's uh, look for a few times that and we can stop it takes a, of course, a little bit of time okay now it's seen diverge somehow but it will run Okay, uh, in the next video, I will show you how to uh, set up the case uh, and how to set up the waves and how to do the post submit, you know, post processing. Mm. Thank you very much and please stay in tune.